Hi, my name is Peach. Let me not waste your time. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to do a glow scan in DaVinci Resolve. First thing we're going to do is grab an adjustment clip and put it over our footage, and then we're going to go into the Fusion page. In the Fusion page, what we're going to do is we're going to hit Shift Space, and we're going to add a bitmap. Shift Enter, and we're still on the search page, and then we're going to grab a fast noise. And then we're going to grab a background node, and then we're going to grab another bitmap. Just like that, and I hit Cancel, and then we're going to get rid of this merge right here. And the way we're going to line up our nodes is that we have a bitmap on top. We'll connect the footage to the bitmap. We're going to hit the bitmap to the fast noise. If we actually hold down Alt, while we go to the node, we're going to hit the noise to brightness map. Then we're going to use the fast noise to go to the background node, to the effects mask. Then we're the background node to the bitmap and the bitmap to the footage. Oh, I think it's not going to go like that. So we're just going to add a, add a merge and they're going to put this bitmap onto the foreground right there. All right, so first thing we're going to do is go to the first bitmap on top and then we're going to go to the channel and then switch it to luminance. Next thing we're going to do is grab over the fast noise and we're going to hit discontinuous over here and we're going to bring the detail all the way down. Hit color and then we're going to change the type to gradient. Let's just use the, the fast noise real quick. All right, so now that we're here, we're going to click the white part of the gradient that we have here, right, right where the arrow is, and then we're going to type in 0 0.025. Next thing I'm going to do is click again to add another point, and then we're going to bring this color to black, and then we're going to type this number 2.05, just like that. So we kind of have like a little border when we look at our fast noise. Next thing we're going to do is go to our background node right here, go to settings, and then we're going to hit the channel right here, and then we're going to change it to luminance. And then we go back to the fast uh, the background color and change it to white. And then let's go back to the fast noise right now while viewing the merge and this, we're going to animate the offset that's right over here so we're going to keyframe the offset from zero and then let's go to the end and then we're going to bring it forward so it goes to around 0.5 or this number right here and it does this kind of animation which is your kind of, kind of glow scan but you can see it's very very pixelated so the way we're going to fix that is with our bitmap so let's view our bitmap right here and we're just going to bring this threshold down so we can get rid of that more pixely bits into something that we like I think that should be fine and let's bring a little bit of a, a bit of a soft edge to that mask all right now we're going to go to the merge that's over here and then we're going to bring the alpha gain just a little bit down so what it's going to do is add a little bit of extra glow to when we when we see it so let's just play it back like this yeah kind of a effect it's a little bit pixelated Maybe we'll adjust some more settings or make the feather go more like that. Something around there. But you can play around with it more. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is go to the spline page, let's click the offset on, and highlight our keyframes here. Let's hit S and assume a graphic goes like this for this effect. Something around here. We play it back. There we go. We got our glow scan. If you have any more questions or suggestions on what I should do in the future, please let me know down below in the comment section. If you'd like to join the Resolve AV Community Discord, there's a link in the description as well as my own server if you'd like to join. And with that, subscribe and have a good day.